Whoa! There you go. Woo! Whoa! Yeah, grave digger. Over me. This video is sponsored by Dr. Otech. All right, guys, we came through with the promise from last video. We successfully 3S swapped Grave Digger. What's up, guys? Today, I don't know if you can tell, but our ramp is totally rebuilt from last time whenever Byron demolished it. <laughs> oh! I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. You know, Goodwill, you went right through the ramp. Don't worry about that. Well, uh, come here real quick. So not only do we have this side fixed, but we also have a brand new other side that we're going to hit. I'm going to try and nail her in the forehead. <laughs> and that's not... Forehead first. Yours is not much bigger than mine, so don't... don't five heads. Y'all both got five heads. Hey. He's got a seven. Don't be jealous. Oh, my gosh. And not only is that our surprise today, we wow, also have cool. another one. Byron. I don't know what you're talking about. 3S swapped Grave Digger, as you can see here. I know a lot of y'all have been waiting on that. A lot of people have been commenting. Can't wait to see it on 3S. Well, today you're going to get to see it on a brand new ramp. So let's get into it. Don't forget about the servo. Got rid of the servo. Oh, yeah. Twitchy. Actually, the servos. <laughs> yeah, as you can tell, the servo is not twitching anymore. Yeah. And Byron put a servo in here that costs more money than the truck does itself. It's just a clunker servo. But we're going <laughs> to see how they do today on the new ramps. Let's get into it. Well, I didn't even get my phone out yet, and Byron already broke Grave Digger. He just sheared off that beautiful orange thing, and Cass is turtled. What are you talking about? I keep getting orange and green mixed up. I'm a lot of stuff mixed up. Dang! Double backflip on broken Grave Digger. Whoa! Oh! Nice. Let's try Bigfoot out here. Oh my God! And he landed it! Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa! Broke both you sides? broke both? You broke the other green side. Wow. Well. That aluminum crap is crap. Yeah, huh? the aluminum is crap. It still runs though and it's broken. <laughs> that thing is evil. Look how evil that thing is. <laughs> oh, yeah. I lost body clips. Oh, you finally lost your green body yeah. clips? All right, Cass, air it out. Nice. Oh, what did you break? Oh, I don't know. Hit it. Oh. Did it just come off or did it break? Um, I don't know. I think it's because. Well, yeah, but you yeah, definitely no, broke no, the no. aluminum parts. No, I broke the pin that goes through it. Oh, well, I might have another pin. In that one got bent. Oh, my God. Well, All that right. was great. Oh, I forgot this tire's already blown out. It was blown out from last time. Here we go. <laughs> oh my god, this thing flips so much. I know, come on, air it out, Cass. Yeah. This ramp is great so far. Oh, nice land. Wow. Oh, I broke something. I broke something on Bigfoot, but he's do, still doing backflips. Oh, almost. What did I do to Bigfoot? Oh, the shot cap broke off or twisted off. I gotta go in and fix that. All right, babe, I gotta go in and fix something. <laughs> she always just took herself out. Over me. Nice. What's up, guys? It's Brett Allen here, bringing you another giveaway of Atraxis Max. This is a brand new red Traxxas Max that you can win at lifeofballin.com now. 
So if you look here, it is brand new. It still has the seal on here. This thing is pretty heavy. And we wanted to give this away to you because we know this is the best RC car you can buy. You're gonna enjoy the heck out of this thing. So our promotion is going on until November 1st. So make sure you go on lifeofballin.com and get yourself some t-shirts. This is a Paddle Gang t-shirt. We have other t-shirts that you can buy on there as well as tickets. So we really hope that you enjoy our content and enjoy winning yourself a brand new Red Traxxas Max today. Thank you. So it was going so fast. It was going so fast that it kind of twisted off. <laughs> Let's look. <laughs> oh, no. She just lost. lost the nut. So that's literally what... This that's, is, that's what hold on, are you still filming? Yeah. This is perfect because guess what? Today's sponsor is Dr. Otech with a metal detector here that we're gonna go and find our wheel nut that Caster's lost out there. So let's get this thing fired up and go find the nut. I, I know where one that's is. That's nuts! <laughs> it is nuts. <laughs> she did exactly what I wanted to do for the video, but not even trying, thank you, babe. This is awesome. These green ones didn't last very long. Oh. So uh, I had to put the stock kind of sort of back ones on. By the way, when it fell or when it came off, I was not filming. I realized I was filming the ground. Well, I bet you missed I bet, a money I bet, shot. I bet, I bet half of the time she was not even filming anything. I know. I'm going to have to go back and look <laughs> at it. And shit. Filming nothing. <laughs> I suck at filming. Tell us what you're doing. I am uh, taking this rod end off because it doesn't have a ball end. And I need, one, I need one that has a ball end on it. All right, guys. Now we are essentially trying to use the Dr. Otec certified metal detector to go and find these nuts that cast blew off of our Max Slash. So let's go test this thing out. As you can tell, it has a display here. It's the Dr. Otec MTXR. It has the depth. We don't really need like, it should be on the surface, but it's looking for screws and nuts right now. It's looking for anything in reality. Yeah, kind of. So we're just gonna... <coughs> oh, hey. See, it found metal. It found something. It found the dog leash. That's not a, that's not a nut. It's gotta be. I wanna know nut. where, <laughs> I'm just kind of scared of where it's at. Oh, the ring camera's metal, I guess. Yeah. Good to know. I mean, of course it's gonna be metal, Brett. It's got, it's got metal in it. It's got gold Copper. in it. Now we have no clue where this happened at over here. Yeah. Oh, I look, mean, look at here. Oh, it doesn't pick it up. Hold on. Yeah, it's aluminum, probably. Mm, it's got all these modes here. I think, I think it's because that's aluminum, Brett. Mm. Oh, it's prob, or I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna put it in my pocket. All right, well, we found- But good eye. Thank you, thank you. We found a clip here. But oh. there's gonna be a lot of pieces out here. Then you're gonna have to find the plastic somehow too. Yeah. It's not oh. just- What is right here? Oh, it found a screw from us building the ramp earlier. Nice. Thank now you. we won't blow our tires out on our RC cars. But that's cool. That I actually found something. Yeah. That looks staged, but it wasn't. No, that was buried <laughs> under something. What did she do over here? Why is the, the there's no grass? No, nah, she tore all the grass up. What a goofball! Oh, well, that's the screws oh. in the way. Oh, yep. Yeah. Mm. Oh. oh, hold on. Right there. Something right there. We might have to go digging for whatever that is. We might actually have hidden treasure over here that we didn't know about. The real question is, what'd your dad hide out here? I don't know. <laughs> he probably hid something. Yeah, there's, there's there's something hidden out here. Dude, there's something in the ground. It says six foot deep. Something six foot deeps right there. Really? Yeah. I was showing you the depth. Wow. And it's a 20, so it's just something... Yeah, normal. A bunch of iron and stuff out here. We haven't found it just yet, but we're not gonna give up. We're gonna go get cast and see where exactly she flipped it at. Let's go do that. Oh, he is microchip. He is microchip. <laughs> Watch the side. 
Now, we have finally gained the location of where it might have happened. And this is over by this big oak tree. I think it's aluminum, Brett. I think it is too. But there's also that plastic piece. Oh, uh, yeah, we ain't planning it. We ain't gonna find that with this, but uh. Is that a plastic detector? No. Okay. That's what Lizzo's for. <laughs> Whoa. It's all about how you hold the thing. It's all about how you swing it. It's all about how you swing the thing. It's how you find the best metal. It's not a sprinkler, it almost just died. What's pee pee? I don't know. Why is it yawning at me? I don't know. I didn't like how pee pee was mad at me. It would have worked, as you can see, it definitely does work on random items. Okay, yeah, found a screw. Okay. That's aluminum. Isn't that fiberglass? 99. Oh, 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 oh. It's singing. It's singing. <laughs> Let's get back to Bigfoot and Grave Digger now. Yes. Thank you, Dr. Otek. For sure. We're going to have fun with this. So along with the metal detector here by Dr. Otech, it actually has one of the best looking boxes I've ever seen. Look at this. It comes with the metal detector and look at this box, it's so cool. Great design, how to get started up here. And it even has headphones, Dr. Otech certified headphones. It even has a little shovel to help you start digging or cutting or whatever you need to do. And it has, this is your this is your quick start guide. And even a little bag here. Let's look at this little bag here. Yeah, a little Dr. Otech duffel bag. So definitely appreciate Dr. Otech for sponsoring this. But the real reason guys that I wanted to get this metal detector is actually because I wanted to give it to my grandpa for Christmas. So I definitely appreciate Dr. Otech for sponsoring this video. All right, we got Bigfoot and grave diggers back out here. We got them fully fixed up. You missed that one. That was I did. Let's see how well this does. Just had to throw a shock cap back on there, but here we go. Yeah, grave digger. Other side. Oh my God, it broke again. There you go. There you go. Woo, whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Jeez, it's crazy! Here comes Grave Digger. <laughs> oh! You broke the ramp already? I broke it at the ramp. Oh, Grave Digger. It, it, it what did you the a Oh, wow. Uh, is that mine? Or is that yours? That's Grave Digger's fan? I think so. Whoa! That was crazy height, man. That was a great one. So you moved a whole ramp that time? Wow. Bigfoot's letting me down with this shock right now. <laughs> that was sick, yeah. <laughs> that was great. Nice land there. Yeah, <laughs> you don't need to learn how to grab. Oh! Oh! Something green fell off. I think it was a body clip. Wait. Oh, no. It was something important. <laughs> oh. oh. That's okay. It's still protecting somehow. <laughs> well. Here. Oh, it works. Yeah. We'll sell it out on the channel for like 10 bucks. There you go. All right. Thank you. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Three has grape diggers crazy. Uh oh. Nice, good oh. land, bar. This ramp was great. Yep. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, chassis's fine. Uh. What was that? What is that noise? Well, I had no power. No, the battery unplugged. Oh, it was the body getting into the gear. <laughs> Did the battery get unplugged? Yeah, the battery unplugged itself. <laughs> I was like, what was that? Well, look at that servo, expensive <laughs> servo here. Ooh, rah, rah. 500. Who needs 500 ounces of torque? On a grave digger, Two you Two wheel do. drive stampede. 
This is not a stampede. It's a grave digger. This is a stampede two-wheel drive. It's a grave digger. Oh, I've been another one of those. You bent that one too? Oh, that one's about to come out. That sounded horrible. That did sound horrible. I guess there's a body catching in that gear. Woo! The metal gears hold up great. It's lasting way longer than Bigfoot, dude. Ooh! Nice land. Yeah! Nice! No, nice self riding there. self riding picture, bro. Oh! Okay, that that hurt. That felt like that hurt. You just skimmed right here. No, nah, it's good. Oh my gosh! Self riding. There you go. I think you're gonna last this whole battery. Oh, it's on red. It's blinking red. It was blinking red, but it's still pulling wheelies. It died right there. Died midair. Well, man, I think you got a pretty good rig here. Other than those stupid things bending and breaking on the back, I guess I need to get the tubes. Yeah. Uh, new one of these. But those thick but green this ones. this right here is original. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the original from Gravedigger. Because remember, whenever we were yanking it through everything yep. and it broke that, yeah, I don't know how that didn't break even more just now. Well, dude, that's amazing. I mean, you just put on 3S, all these upgrades you've done to it, and it's lasting a whole battery with you, Byron. I can't believe it. Did a backflip on dead. Uh, on dead. So Grave Digger did totally amazing for Byron here. Grave Digger on 3S is quite amazing. Blinking, but you know, whatever. And his raw 500 servo that costs more than Grave Digger is absolutely amazing. Than pretty much everything on the truck. That is true. So Byron has pretty much made this, I would say almost Byron proof, if not Byron yeah, proof. We just gotta figure out the back things. I just gotta get tubes or something for it. That is the, true. The, the, thick, the thickums. Yeah, cause he broke these. He put these on and he snapped these right off. Both of both them. Both of them, both fights. So that's terrible. But anyway, you come over here to my Bigfoot and uh, he's having a shock cap issue. Here's the shocks. Oh, that's a hot ESC. Let me tell you what, boys. I bet. And this Holy is pulling smoke. out. But besides that, oh, we're doing quite all right. So guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. The, the car bit my finger, Charlie. Drunky drunkerson over here. I found a nut. Yeah, that is a big nut. That's a very large nut you have there, sir. All right, well, let's get back what to the big foot. What did you foot. say? No, don't worry about it. <laughs>